Frisky's Crypto Cave here, and today's video is just going to be a short update on the farm. Got a couple things I was going to talk about. Uh, I'm trying something out with the fans. Um, AC Infinity has an automated programming thing that you can do for cooling. And currently it is 98 in the shed. It is 81 degrees outside. So I have it set up. I'm going to pull up my phone here quick to get the app. And there we go. 98. Automation 1. Let's see. There's some of the things I have set up. Probably should just do a screen recording is what I probably should do, but uh, I had the first target temperature is at 85. And then minimum level is 3, maximum level 10. And it's every 5 degrees. And it was currently about 3 degrees over 95. So we're at... Should, it does make sense. In the middle of level 3, every 5 degrees, it's going to kick up the fans one speed. Uh, so that basically once it hits um, 85, it's going to bump up the speed 4. Once it hits 90, it's going to go to 5. Once it hits 95, it's going to go to 6. Then once we hit 100, it'll go to 7. Uh, I may have to bump it up a tiny bit. And then if I do, you see on the phone, if I put the minimum at 3 right now, if I change that to 4, come on. There we go. I'm going to change it to 4 and hit done. I'm going to save it. And you can see, fans are bumping up to 7. So I've been messing around with this the last few days. I want to try to keep the shed in between 90 and 95. Uh, it seems like the cars run good, everything like that. It doesn't use too much power. So I, I think before, without using this, I had the fans running at an excessive speed, and it was just using more power than it really should have. Not really sure how much it's going to save, but hey, a little bit helps. So this pretty much as far as what's running has been the same. KS2 is still running, not profitable. CM, the second CMP cards, those are making about 25 cents a rig. There's the, the original CMP card rig, that's about the same. 3080s are still off. It should take this time to clean them, because you can see there's some pollen and dust and whatnot built up on them. Um, KS zeros are still on. I may actually switch those to Stoli mining here shortly. Um, I do have a AL0 that should be delivered on Tuesday. Uh, so I'll be able to get that set up on Wednesday, get that thing up and running. Um, all the 3070s are still on, 2080 Ti's are off, and the 3060 Ti's are off. So, you can see, power usage, nowhere near capacity, you have plenty of headspace. Um, the two S19's, we still got them hammering away. Um, S19K Pro is at 120, and the... 104 is running at about 66 to 68 terahash, right around 1500 watts. Running good. Right now, according to like the software, the 104 on brains is actually more efficient than the 120 on the Epic. Do that. It makes me even think maybe I should try brains on the, on the one the S19K and uh, see how efficient I can get that. But it seems like, like the S19K Pro runs better uh, when the chips are much warmer. So. It actually it's been, it seems like it's been running better at the 120 than it has been if I tried it down to it. Just because it wasn't getting warm enough. No. Other than that, there's not much going on out here. Some of the other things I'll go over. Uh, I want to cover it all. It's in the house. Uh, so I'm going to go do that. Head in the house and cover that with you. Alrighty, we're back in the house. And as you can hear, this is the one issue. This is my Canon Avalon Nano 3. Fans are noisy. Um, I did email them, open up a ticket. Actually, this happened about a month ago, maybe even a little bit longer. And then all of a sudden, it quieted down. So I was like, okay, well, I'll just keep it running and not do it. And then it started up again. So um, I think the game plan is I'm just going to shut her down. 
RMA it, get the fans replaced, because it is still under warranty. It does come with a one-year warranty. And the support has been good to deal with. Can't really complain about that, so there wasn't really many issues there. So I just, they gave me the RMA number. I just got to get boxed up and sent out. So I'll probably do that this week as well. Just because I'm going to get taken care of while it will still be free. Well, I have to pay for shipping, but uh, the repairs and stuff will be free. And then if it does break again after warranty, I'll probably just look into doing um, Noctua fans or something like that. See if they make a size that will fit in there. So um, that's, that's the next part of the update. And then the last one, I'll be right next. Yeah, I'm recording a part of this video again just to splice it in because I guess the filter on the mic kind of edited out the all the fan noise. And as you can hear, not very quiet. This is going to be getting RMA'd and sent back for warranty work. And the last part's um, part of the reason where I'm going to be trying to edit this on my laptop because um, actually I have a salad job on my editing rig and desktop that has been earning pretty much see, about five bucks a day. So uh, I took a pay out of that 20 bucks, sent it to PayPal. Yeah, it'd probably be better off waiting. I'll probably wait to do the next one at like 100 or something like that, just depending on. If I keep it running or not, but um, it's been doing pretty well the last day or two. So we'll go over here to seven days. I can't do a screen recording just because I'll lose a job. Uh, but had a couple stinker days here, but uh, 271 there, 498 there, got 290 so far today. So um, overall, pretty good. Not complaining at all. Pretty much right around five cents an hour, pretty much for the entire day. A little bit lower, a little bit of a drop there, a little bit of a peak here, so. But, yeah, it's actually been going pretty well. So that's kind of, we're not doing a screen recording on this, like I said, but the, uh, um, not too shabby. This rig has a 3700X, 64 gigs of RAM, and a 4070 Ti Super is what this has. So, you can see the last 17 days, they earned about, the last seven days earned about 1737, so. Not bad. It's been most of the time the desktop is idle, so I don't use it except for editing and stuff like that. Usually on Wednesdays, Wednesdays and Sundays, so put it to good use, earn some extra cash, and now it's running cash, and I don't want to stop it from earning money because I need to edit. So I'm going to try to edit this on the laptop. So my editing, I don't do a whole lot of editing anyway, but at least piece it together and stuff and upload it to YouTube. So, but. Um, I, like I said at the end of the video, we have the uh, AL0 coming on Tuesday. Um, I have a BidX coming as well. That was supposed to be delivered yesterday, but I got shipping delayed with UPS. And a couple other things got in the works. So, but just keep an eye out. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe to videos for more content. So, take it easy. We'll catch you on the next one. Catch you later.